to the universe. Your crown chakra collaborates with your hair to communicate with the universe. If you got weave and wig, I'm just being honest, ladies. You are suffocating your spirit. You are suffocating your crown chakra. Hat, weave, wig, whatever you want to call it. Let your scalp breathe, black woman. Our spirit is in our head. It is in our heart. It is in our belly. That's why you shouldn't always be stuffed up with food because you don't get those messages through your belly. Overeating is not good. You disturb the belly. You have a consciousness in your stomach. That's why you shouldn't carry anger and regret and shame and fear in your heart because your heart communicates to you. But your heart can't communicate you if it's trapped with anger, fear, frustration, disappointment. Your third eye wants to talk to you. Your crown chakra wants to talk to you. But you got weave and wig and perm. And then you put a weave in your daughter's hair. Lord, underdeveloped pineal gland and you already suffocating it. Underdeveloped pineal gland and you already suffocating it. We are in the age of Aquarius. Aquarius is a planet of revolt. We are in the age of Aquarius. Aquarius is a planet of revolt. Pluto is in Aquarius. Pluto is a planet of revolutionary endings and revolutionary beginnings. Pluto will be with Aquarius for the next couple years and we will be in the age of Aquarius for the next hundred, several hundred years. It's time for black people to transform ourselves. We need new ideas, new ways to organize, new ways to build, new ways to create family. You're in the age of Aquarius. Why you keep on using outdated ways? Sankofa, go back and get what you need. Leave the rest. Take the protein. Leave the rest. Do you do meet and greets? This is what I'm about to do. My New Orleans family gave me an idea yesterday. My New Orleans family gave me an idea yesterday with the two meet and greets. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put together a package for black businesses. I'm going to put together a meet and greet package for black businesses where I'll come into your city. And that whole day or two days, I'm going to go around and spend two hours a piece at each of five black businesses, four to six black businesses. Y'all going to pay me for this because my movement has to be financed and I'm going to come to the barbershop and spend two hours. People can do a meet and greet, drop in, get some wine. I'm going to go to another black business, spend two hours. People can drop in, meet and greet Dr. Umar, and they might get some finger food. And then I'm going to go to another black business for two hours, meet and greet, and they might get some desserts, some black desserts. And then I go to another black business for two hours and do a meet and greet, and they'll get something. So everywhere they come, there will be something there for them free. And they meet and greet. And when they come in, I'm going to motivate them to buy black at your shop. Where my black businesses at who can benefit from a Dr. Umar meet and greet at your store? 
who ain't getting enough business at their black shop and they need Dr. Umar to come through for a meet and greet. We're going to do a black business meet and greet. Black business meet and greet, brothers and sisters. I was in San Bernardino last year or two years ago. But we got to do some more meet and greets to save black businesses. So if you have five black businesses in your city and you ready to set up the Dr. Umar meet and greet, you need five businesses, four, no less than four. No less than four. We can do the meet and greets. I'm going to put it on my social media. Everybody going to know I'm there. Come through. Meet and greet and buy products. You're going to give them 10% off they purchase. 20% off they purchase. I'm going to be your coupon. I'm going to be your walking advertisement and your walking coupon. San Jose. Y'all got black businesses in San Jose? Let's do the black business meet and greet tour with Dr. Umar. The black business meet and greet tour with Dr. Umar. I'm about to put together a teen summit for the youth. I'm about to put together a teen summit for the youth. Black business meet and greet in Atlanta. Let's set it up. Black business meet and greet in Little Rock, Arkansas. Let's set it up. Black business meet and greet in Jackson, Mississippi. Let's set it up. Black business meet and greet in Phoenix, Arizona. Let's set it up. Black meet and greet Omaha, Nebraska. Black business meet and greet in Detroit. Let's set it up. Stop trying to give me your cookies, Sister K. Stop trying to give me your cookies, baby. I don't need no cookies right now. Black business meet and greet in Manchester, England. Black business meet and greet in Kingston, Jamaica. Black business meet and greet in Puerto Viejo, Costa Rica. Black business meet and greet Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. We can't talk about it. We, I want to do a black farmers meet and greet. Where are my black farmers at? Let's do a black farmers meet and greet. Let's do the black farmers meet and greet. Let's do a black doula meet and greet. Black doula meet and greet. I think I need to do my own black restaurant meet and greet. Do I need to do a black restaurant meet and greet where I come through and sample your food on the Instagram live? Do the commercial, the advertise, them oxtails, that seafood, that vegan food, that vegetarian food. Let's do that black Trent in New Jersey black business meet and greet. Where that Newark, New Jersey black business meet and greet. Turn up season. Turn up season. Black massage parlor. Oh, yes. You mean I'm going to get a I'm going to get a back massage from four different queens in the same day. Lord have mercy. I'm going to get a back massage from four different queens in the same oh yes let's do the black massage parlor meet and greet lord have mercy let's do the black massage parlor meet and greet washington dc black business meet and greet all y'all got to do is get in touch with king Kong. testosterone shots for the zesty crew no thank you we're going to pass on that y'all tell me how y'all want to work it and we're going to work it we could do a black daycare meet and greet. 
black daycare meet and greet, black barbershop meet and greet. I'm just trying to jumpstart Black Wall Street family. Black psychology meet and greet. <laughs> yeah. Black Black Fitness Center meet and greet. I'm with that. I'm with a Black Fitness Center. You got your own Black Fitness gym? We could do a black fitness center tour. We can do a black. We're not doing no black porn, my brother. We shouldn't be looking at that. We shouldn't be looking at that. We shouldn't be looking at that. You must be thirsty. You ain't got no queen you can call over, my brother. You ain't got no queen you can call over and massage on, sister. Sister, you ain't got no brother. You look, brother, you ain't got no queens you can call on. You ain't got no queens you can call on. You got to look at artificial sex. Come on, my brother. You got to look at artificial sex. Come on, my brother. Where your queen them at? Get your queens up. You got to get your queens up. Got to get your queens up. You ain't got no cheeks. You can go. Come on, my brother. You stop hating on Dr. Umar. Start working on the queens. You got to get your queens up. That's a, that's a real difficult life. You ain't got no Cinnabons to warm you up at night. That's a very boring life, my brother. You must got a very lonely life. What's another kind of meet and greet we can do? Get your queens up. What's another kind of meet and greet we can do? What's another kind of meet and greet? We talked about restaurants. We talked about fitness centers. We talked about massage parlors. What's another kind of... Uh, shout out to the Ebony Queens. They only got the BBLs, no Cinnabons. That's sad. A real estate meet and greet. We could do that. We could do a real estate office meet and greet. Make sure the black realtors is getting enough clientele. We can do that. We can do the black realtors. I'm going to put together a tour. I'm going to start working on it. Black coffee shop meet and greet. Black bookstore meet and greet. Black media meet and greet. Ah. Black, uh, uh, what you want to call it? The whole black people who sell herbs and, uh, what do we want to call that? What do we want to call that? Apothecary. What's that? When they sell the herbs and everything you need for your body. Naturopathic meet and greet. Black firearms meet and greet. That'd be strong. That'd be strong. Black financial literacy meet and greet. That's a good one. Black owned restaurant. I'm always re McDonald's meet and greet. Nah, family. We're not doing McDonald's meet and greet. And stop making me think about McDonald's. I'm trying not to think about McDonald's. You're going to have me going through a relapse. I'm trying to. I'm trying to overcome my addiction to that double filet of fish with the cheese. Please don't bring up McDonald's. I'm working on, I ain't been to McDonald's in a little bit. Please don't bring back those post-traumatic, those post-traumatic filet of fish meal dreams with that strawberry shake and the two apple pies and the oatmeal raisin cookie. Please don't make, please, brothers and sisters, I'm trying to, I'm trying not to relapse. I'm trying not to relapse. Black farmers is a must. I want to do a black gardeners meet and greet. People who got their own little family garden, community garden. Pull up and eat a cucumber with some salt on it. Pull up and eat some celery with some peanut butter. I want to make love to a queen in the garden one day. Before I die, I want to make love to a queen in the garden. Any queens out there want to go half on a on a on a on a on a on a black magic session with King Kong? 
in a garden, in a food garden. Any queens want to go half on a black magic se session with the king? I'm just playing around. We must stay focused, Tay Tay. We must stay focused. <laughs> he said, oh, yes. <laughs> okay, y'all, Q&A. What questions y'all got? I'm going to ask the questions. Text me some questions. Time for the questions. I'm about to put together a spiritual retreat in Delaware. I'm working on a spiritual retreat in Delaware. I'm working on a white supremacy detox retreat. I'm working on a white supremacy detox retreat. Am I watching a debate? I'll catch the replay. Brooke Tyler, why are you so beautiful? Toronto, we will be rescheduling. Where is the school? I will not answer a, such a ridiculous question. When am I coming to California? As soon as y'all invite me. School is coming along. Come help us paint Saturday and Sunday. We got a paint day. Saturday and Sunday. Why do you repeat yourself? Because I need you to make sure you understand what I'm saying. Biden or Trump, neither one. I'm not voting unless I get a reason to vote. Connecticut, where's the invitation? Can we save this generation? Yeah, we just got to get rid of the adults. Brooklyn, where's the invitation? How do you feel about Mayor Sherelle Park in Philadelphia starting year-round school? Well, she doesn't control schools. The state controls the school. So maybe she got the state legislature to approve year-round school. I'm not against year-round school. I used to be assistant principal at a year-round school. Yes, you can donate to the school. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the PayPal, paypal.me slash FDMG Academy. I will be on a breakfast club January the 9th, Tennessee, Memphis. Sierra Leone, where's the invitation? You want me in a garden right now, Sister K Stacks? Cornell West running for president. He's married to a sand bunny. July 9th Breakfast Club. What's the next question? Can we meet and greet when you come to the breakfast club? You're not allowed in there. They got security. I just thought of something. You know what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to do a meet and greet New York after the breakfast club interview on July 9th. Breakfast club interviews are early. The breakfast club interviews are early. So I think I'm going to do my first black business Meet and greet in New York City. Where my New York City black business is at? Where my New York City black business is at? Where my New York City black business is at? Where my New York City... You know what? I think we're going to kick it off in New York City. I think we're going to kick it off in New York City. I think we're going to kick it off in New York City. Soon I leave the Breakfast Club interview on July 9th. What I'm going to do is I'm going to have the black businesses... Who want to do the meet and greet. You're going to get. Two hours. And you're going to donate. Five hundred dollars for those two hours. And for those two hours. Anybody who wants to see Dr. Umar. Can come to your store. For those two hours. You're going to give them a certain discount. For those two hours. You're going to have some snack foods. Some wine or some. You know some some. Punch. Or some th what do y'all think, brothers and sisters? I think this is going to go well for the summertime. What do y'all think, brothers and sisters? In fact, every way I'm scheduled to speak, it just came to me. God is good. The ancestors. So I got Columbia, South Carolina. If you a black business in Columbia, 
If you a black business, I got Columbia coming up. I got Newark, New Jersey coming up. I got uh, New York City coming up. So that's three black business meet and greets. I'm going to do Philadelphia because I live in Philly. That's easy. Camden, New Jersey, we can do that anytime. That's easy. Washington, D.C., black business meet and greet. Baltimore, where my black Baltimore business is at? You're going to pay $500 for the two hours. You can structure the meet and greet any kind of way you want. If you want a Q&A, that's fine. If we just going to take pictures and questions, that's fine. Black business meet and greet in every city where Dr. Umar is scheduled to speak. So you got to check my calendar. You got to check my calendar. You got to check my calendar. Wilmington, Delaware, we're going to do a black business meet and greet. $500. That's nothing to pay. Because you're going to get posted on my social media. I'm going live from your business. I'm not doing this for the money. I'm doing this for the exposure. But I got projects that need funding. I think $500. What would you have to pay? If you went to a, 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 a marketing company and said, I want to be posted on somebody's Instagram who got over a million followers. I want him to come to my store, go live with me where I'm going to talk about my store. People are going to come there to meet him. He's going to make them buy and per that's a steal. Five hundred dollars is a steal. It's up to y'all. It's completely up to y'all. I'm just trying to help black businesses. $500 ain't nothing for two hours with Big Papa live on Instagram. Live on Instagram for two hours in your store. Everybody coming in to see the prints. We could have a little wine party at your store. We could have a tea party. London, I'm going to do it when I come to London too. August 11th, London, England. Are you ready? We don't all come from Africa. Well, listen, if you still stuck on that, it ain't nothing I could say. At this point, at this point, if you don't want to be African, that's on you. Mm. Reading, Pennsylvania. We could do it from Reading, Pennsylvania. We got some pretendians in the chat. Any restrictions on the service? It can't be nothing inappropriate. I am an educator. It can't be nothing inappropriate, right? So we ain't doing nothing for your escort service or zesty massage parlor. It can't be nothing that's not consistent with what I, you know, stand for. Fort Lauderdale meet and greet. That'd be off the chain in Fort Lauderdale. We need to do a South Africa black business meet and greet. That'd be off the hook. Kingston, Jamaica black business meet and greet. Y'all done gave me a new idea. I'm about to post up right now. I'm about to post up right now. <laughs> 